We begin with an update on the death investigation on a nearly two-year-old girl in Montcalm County. 13 on your side's Emma Nicholas has been following this from the beginning. And she joins us now with the very latest. Emma, we now know what investigators currently think about this case. That's right. Michigan State Police have officially deemed Veda Vasquez's death as suspicious. This comes after MSP spent hours investigating the babysitter's home where Veda was found unresponsive early Monday morning. Veda's cause of death, however, will not be released until the, until the autopsy is completed today. Police have not released further details at this point. Veda's father, Christopher Sanchez, says he hopes whoever is responsible for his child's death is prosecuted. And I hope that whoever did this and Whoever is tied into it, I hope they get what they deserve because she was, she was an angel. She should have never, I shouldn't ever have to be, bury my daughter. Veda was under the guardianship of her maternal grandmother, Tanya Rose, who, according to court records, had been caring for the child since she was just a few months old, out of concerns of substance abuse by Veda's parents. Rose lived only a mile away from the babysitter's home on West Stan Road. Veda's mother, Danielle Maybe, is currently in Ionia County Jail on drug-related charges. Veda's father says he had been working toward a stable life where he could regain custody of his daughter. We'll continue to follow this, of course. Juliet.